Why is a bedtime snack not the best thing for your metabolism or your hormones? Let's talk about it. One of the things that we really need for balanced hormones is actually a balanced cortisol melatonin pattern. And when you're eating before bed, this actually throws that cortisol melatonin pattern out of whack. The thing is, every single time we eat, we make a little bit of cortisol. This is not necessarily a bad thing, but at nighttime, when our bodies are supposed to be winding down and moving into repair mode, cortisol is going to oppose melatonin. The second part of this conversation is that leptin needs to dock to the hypothalamus while we're sleeping, while we're in this deep repair mode so that it can give a download of how much stored energy is on the body. This in turn is going to affect your thyroid, your sex hormones, your bone health, your immune system, all of these things are signaled by this process happening every night when you're sleeping. Guess what competes with leptin for docking space at the hypothalamus? Insulin. So if you're having a bedtime snack and it is raising your insulin, this can stop this process with leptin also happening along with slowing down the production of melatonin. If you want to learn more about how to set up your optimal day for cortisol, melatonin, and your metabolism, check out some of my free guides linked to my bio or my metabolism repair kits. Save up to 45% on those. Also top link in my bio if you have any questions.